Hello everyone. Happy April. Let's move this down a bit. <laughs> Hello everyone. Um, we are in April officially, which means it's time to look over last month, which was March. So I do want to get to using this more. We will be using this more this a month in April, but for right now we are trucking along, okay? Okay. Ba -da 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 -da. Is that good? Is that in frame? Okay, hopefully. <laughs> so, it is that time again. At the end of every month, I go over what I spent that month, how much I spent on what category in my life, and overall just the actual physical number of how much money I spent that month. So, it is that time again. So March was a five week month, so I did get an extra paycheck. I also spent more money. So I do expect this number to be higher than February's. Not a bad thing. It was long, um, but just so we are both on the same page, I do expect this number to be quite high. Um, we did a trip out uh, for Easter to Mississippi to see my sister-in-law. Um, so that took some gas and things and excuses, excuses. I think this will be a very high month. Um, we will see. I also had not been great at cash stuffing. So I do know that stuff got a little lost in the sauce, um, but I'm hopeful it won't be too bad. <laughs> I don't know what too bad is for me right now, to be honest, <sighs> but let's do it, okay? So we have house. This is rent mostly, um, but we also pay internet um, and like, we have an Apple subscription for like a dollar a month. I think it's storage <laughs> for my work. So I couldn't really tell you. Got groceries. We have gas. We got eating out. Pets. Miscellaneous. And I think that's it. Let me make sure none of this miscellaneous could be categorized into something. Unfortunately, does not look like it. <laughs> okay. I had decided that the sinking funds are going to be kind of separate from this because I want this just to be like expenses. So pets is on here, not because I added money to the pet sinking fund, but because I took money out of it. So if I don't take money out of a sinking fund, I'm not going to put it on here as like spent money. Um, so let us begin. <laughs> this will be a long one. Uh, kind of bear with me. There's a lot of itemized things on my list. So I have a spreadsheet and anytime I buy something, I say what it is, what category goes into the date and how much it was. So for instance, I paid rent on the first for $800. I bought a book on the ninth for $6. Um, stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I've kind of got stuff. We had a party. We bought party supplies on the 15th for $23. Um, so just stuff like that. And just to help me keep track, it especially helps when you like go and look at receipts because it has the date and the store. So you can just match that up and be like, oh, this is a duplicate. I already have this confirmed and in fetch and whatnot. So you don't need to have to worry about accidentally recording a purchase twice and stuff like that. Okay, so... As I just said, rent was raised. Um, oof. And I paid taxes this month. Um, so I paid to have my taxes filed. I did get a refund, which was very nice. So I did not get a refund last year. I owed a lot of money last year, so not a lot. I owed like $700, which is a lot to me, but I know a lot of people pay a lot more in taxes. Okay, so with taxes, the Apple, um, the rent, which is higher now, it's 800 a month now. And with internet, house cost us 1,052. That is a high number. Okay. Groceries. Bought a lot of groceries. 41, 85, 13, 108. Wow, these are expensive grocery trips. 48. 13, 11, spent $319 on groceries. Our grocery budget is only 
480, 440. Oof. So we overspent on that definitely. Um, like I said, gas is going to be more because we did take quite the trip out to Mississippi, which is about um, another eight hour drive. It looks like we make one every month nowadays, <laughs> but it is what it is. 40, uh, 45 and 46 and another 46. Yeah. 304. So that is also about a hundred dollars over budget. Okay, eating out, 40, 46, 14, 11, 16, 50, 30, 10, 16, 20, 253. That is a lot of money, though it's not great. Um, looks like the pets got free medicine new lights one of the lizard lights went out um and i think that's food so from pets we spent 66 dollars and then miscellaneous is a whole lot of different stuff it's uh i bought a game i bought a book we went to staples to print out tax forms got ice cream from udf um stuff like that well i might sneeze um but i'm just gonna add all of that together because it's like unbudgeted things that just pop up so two I think that's an eight 29 and three okay Be -do -do -do. <laughs> so yeah this is expensive 1052 319 304 253 66 and 109 so interesting still less expensive than January, um, which could just be because I was kind of new to cash stuffing and budgeting in general and like wasn't great at it. Um, but I'm not upset with this number, especially because we had an extra paycheck and it helped a lot, right? So when you bring in a whole extra, I think for me it was $700. That's great. <laughs> um, at a full work week, I will make $760 a week. So 3000 so saved $1,000. That's pretty good to me. <laughs> um, okay, so we are officially done with three months of the year. So quarter one is officially finished. That will mean that we'll do a review of um, what the yearly goals were, how much we've been spending versus savings, and um, kind of just taking a look at the review for the last three months to see if there's anything specific we need to change in the next three months to help us kind of reach our goals and do better on uh, just what we're trying to achieve. So if you're interested in that video, hang around. Um, we're about halfway through April already, but I do want to do possibly a setup at least for the last two weeks um, and just kind of talk about what April will look like. So if you're interested in that, please hit subscribe and look out for the new video. Like this video, um, just to encourage some others to uh, budget along with us and you know, reflect on your finances. You know, budgeting is only half of the uh, of the equation. If you don't look back and see what you actually spent, you can't help your budget to help you not spend. So have a good night, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I super duper appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>